Now we will solve another problem under when the body is placed on the incline. What is the given problem? The body on the 30 degrees incline in figure is acted upon by the force P inclined at 20 degrees with the horizontal. If P is resolved into components parallel and perpendicular to the incline and the values of the parallel component is 300 newtons, uh, compute the value of the perpendicular component and of P. Here, data. What is the data here? Incline. Inclination with ground is equal to 30 degrees and force P is making an angle 20 degrees with the ground. Force P, force P is inclination with ground is equal to 20 degrees. Now, it's given Px value and Py value. What is Px? Px is force component parallel to the incline is equal to 300 newtons py force component perpendicular to the incline to be find out Here, the body is placed on the incline and X is the component parallel to the incline and Y is the component parallel to the Here, X is parallel to the incline and Y is normal to the incline. The force P is uh, making an angle 20 degrees to the ground. This is the line parallel to the ground say P its inclination with the ground is 20 degrees. Now we have to find the Py value. Py means force component normal to the incline. Now this is the incline. Parallel to the incline, this is the line drawn. As the ground is making an angle 30 degrees, so this ground line parallel to the ground line also makes an angle 30 degrees. So this total angle becomes 50 degrees. This total angle becomes 50 degrees. Now we'll resolve the force P into 
parallel to the incline as well as normal to the incline. P cos 50 as it is 50 degrees and this one is P sin 50 P sin 50 so instead of placing like this we can place in another way also suppose P is the force to this we have to draw normal as well as parallel to the incline this is the 50 degrees angle this is p it is p cos 50 and it is p sin 50 Here, parallel component value is given that is parallel component say Px is equal to 300 Newtons. Px is equal to P cos 50 degrees which is equal to 300 then P is equal to 300 by cos 50 degrees which is equal to 466.71 Newtons. Then we have to find perpendicular component say Py is equal to P sin 50 degrees which is equal to 466.71 as p value is 466.71 into sin 50 degrees which is equal to 357.52 as it is coming down that's why it is negative therefore p is equal to 466.71 newtons and py is equal to 357.52 newtons